Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm doing makeup on the beautiful Yasmin Evans. Yasmin is a DJ at One Extra and I'm gonna make her look beautiful, so stay tuned. So the first product I'm using is a product from Urban Decay. This is the Naked Skin Foundation. Now Yasmin, you love this foundation, it's don't you? It's my favourite. It feels so nice. It's, quite, it's nice because it's lightweight, mm -hmm. but you can still build on it. Yeah. So any red carpet events or just any sort of everyday usage, you can use this. I love it. So I'm just going to use a concealer. This is the MAC Studio Finish Concealer. I'm going to use a lighter one just underneath the eyes and a darker one just to contour underneath the cheekbones just to enhance the face shape. Okay, so I'm just going to set the foundation now. I'm using the Fashion Fair Powder, pressed powder in cashew. I love this powder because it has a nice coverage and it also mattifies the skin. Okay. So I'm going to use the Mineralized Skin Finish Powder from MAC as a bronzer. This one is in Dark Deep. So Yasmin, you've been working at One Extra for how long? Um, for about three years now. And do you love it? Absolutely love it. Like four years ago, I was working in a sunbed shop. Oh my God, really? Yeah, and I was just a community radio presenter, which is like, you kind of standard radio sort of station in like your community area mm. in Manchester. How did you break through to One Extra then? Um, believe it or not, I just tweeted a producer. Yeah. I'd like about Four, about four years ago, four or five years ago, yeah, I tweeted her. Mm -hmm. It's just something about music. I had no idea how to use Twitter at the time, and I was really new to it. Um, and I just kind of researched producers and radio, just really into radio, rather than speaking on a microphone, like mm -hmm. production and stuff. So, yeah, we're just back and forth, tweeting, and she sent me an email. That's why I always say to people, like, have like-minded conversations mm. with people that are interested in your stuff. So that was never it. know where life can take you. Exactly. With a tweet. There yeah. you go. Just one tweet. <laughs> <laughs> and my whole life changed. <laughs> Did I tweet you though? I tweeted you and then we're now lovers. Yeah. <laughs> Best friends. <laughs> Alright babe. Jeez. <laughs> so I'm moving on to the eyebrows now and this is a MAC pencil. This is the Velux Brow Liner in Deep Dark Brunette. So I'm just going to use a Prolong Wear Paint Pot by MAC, and this is Indian Wood. I'm placing this all over the eyelid. So Yasmin, the last time I did your makeup was at One Extra Live. Yeah. That has to be one of my favourite jobs I've oh, ever really? done. I loved it. It was so much fun. Mm. Um, I think it was brilliant that we got to have a bigger budget for it. Yeah, <laughs> definitely. And do you know what? I think the rider just sold it for me. Oh what yeah. Was, what was your rider? Oh god, it's gonna make me sound so arrogant, but um, it's very basic. Just have to make sure there's <laughs> ginger beer and rum on there. Yeah. And Obviously. most importantly, some sour cream and chive Pringles. Just to make your breath <laughs> smell amazing. <laughs> I'm now going to use my Urban Decay Naked Smoky Palette and I'm going to use the colour Whiskey. I'm going to place that on the outer corners, so the kind of V section that we have here. So one of my favourite colours is from another Urban Decay palette and this is the Naked, the original Naked palette. And the colour is called Half Baked, so I'm going to place that on top in here, just on the, in the centre of the eye. So 
So I'm going to go in with my favourite eyeliner. This is the Laura Mercier Cream Eyeliner in Noir. You just look towards me. I'm going to go in with a black eyeliner. This is from Urban Decay. It's the All Nighter Eyeliner in Perversion. And just look up for me. <laughs> I'm now going to use the Urban Decay Gwen Stefani palette and I'm going to go in with Blackout. This is such a nice black which is really matte. Look up for me. And it's really long lasting as well. And we're going to use this to smoke out the eye. So, Yasmin, what is your favourite song that's out at the moment? What do you love playing on radio? Ooh, oh, that is a tough one. It is. I really like this Ricky Blaze song. It's called Apart. It's like it's very summery. There's not much mm. to it because right now when I'm listening to music, I don't like too much fuss. Mm. Like I like something that's quite repetitive, and I think because it's winter, I'm kind of aiming towards something that's gonna reassure me that summer's arriving. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, we're this, still waiting. Yeah. This uh, Ricky Blaze song, which is called Apart, is just fun, and it's such a flirty type song. Um, what kind of genre of music? Is um, that? it's got like elements of reggae to it okay um it's a little bit it's very instrumental um yeah it kind of reminds you of something that you listen to on holiday you know when you just want to listen to a holiday soundtrack there's not too much going on yeah you know what you're gonna listen to you know it's gonna sound summery and yeah so i'm gonna apply some eyelashes now these are my favorite eyelashes from ardell these are the wispies they're really, they're really nice and fan out the eyes, just to open them out a little bit more. So I'm going to go in with the lipstick. Now this one is from YSL. This is the Rouge Percature lipstick in number 54. It's a nice plum colour, which I think is going to look really lovely on you. So I'm going to use a MAC lip liner. This is Vino. I'm now using the YSL Mascara in Volume Effect Folks Phyllis Waterproof Lash Mascara in Black. Slip down for me. So I'm just going to finish off the look now just using a blusher. This one is Dolce Vita by NARS. So I'm just going to finish off Yasna's makeup by using a Radiance Matte Transparent Powder by YSL and then Sharon's going to come in and finish the hair for the photo shoot. <laughs> 